and gentlemen, to another horror review. I am your host, The Strange Monkey. And today, damn it, I'm gonna be talking about one of the coolest movies of 2021. Oh yeah, you better believe it. We're talking about Tapehead, motherfuckers. Tapehead is directed by Dustin Matson, and it stars Dustin Matson, Chris Daniel, Michael Lindstrom, and Dylan Weeks. In 2001, a tragic prank took the life of mentally challenged video store rewinder Jacob Cobb. Twenty years later, Jacob's corpse has been inadvertently awakened by three hapless goons who have big plans of reopening the video barn. Cashing in on the urban legends which surround Jacob's death will be the least of their worries as the once innocent video store clerk returns from the grave to exact his revenge. Oh shit. I had a lot of fun with this film. This is very schlocky and it pays homage to a lot of horror films from the past, lots of slashers, anthologies. You see it all in here. You got Rotten Roger DeMarco and Evil from 3D Video and you got VHS Mikey. These guys, when they're together working on stuff, it's magic. Okay, it's awesome. If you've seen their stuff on YouTube, good stuff. I highly recommend that you subscribe to their channel. My mind almost went blank, but we're going to keep it moving and focus on this film that has it all. If you're into a lot of indie horror movies, this is it. This is what you should be getting for Christmas. Link in the description. That's right, link in the description. I'm serious. Fucking buy it right now. But yeah, this is no Oscar winner, and it doesn't need to be, all right? Yeah, it could be a little cheesy over the top or whatever the case may be, but that's the beauty of it. Because Dustin Matson did such a fucking awesome job directing this, all right? He's a cool dude. He knows what he's doing. This is low-budget horror at its finest you work with what you got and I love the character of Jacob Cobb the tape head holy shit you've got to put this guy up against Freddy Jason Pinhead Chucky well uh, I don't know about Chucky he'll stop him in seconds I was so impressed with the kills in this movie the gore and the lighting that was such a big thing for me the lighting reminded me of such films as Creepshow. And you've got awesome comic book transitions. I love that type of artwork in movies. Tapehead just proves that sometimes you don't need a massive budget to achieve your goal. I, I must say, Dustin Matson, you, sir, directed the shit out of this movie. All right? This is a love letter to lots of old school films from the past. And you guys knocked it out of the park. Everybody that worked on this film, pat yourselves on the show. Hey, beautiful, magnificent. I'm pretty sure that the road to getting this film done was a rough one. But damn it, they succeeded. The characters are awesome. The story is awesome. The special effects, just out of this world. I loved it, okay? Tapehead, ladies and gentlemen, is one hell of a good time. Strange Monkey approved. Go pick up a copy, please. You will not be disappointed. I promise you. This is good stuff here, okay? This is definitely one of my top ten of the year. Yes, that's right, I said it. The little indie film that could. They should make a book about this film, and that's what they need to call it, okay? Practical effects always beats CGI. Remember that. And that's all I've got to say about Tapehead. Okay? Support indie horror. Be sure to subscribe. Click on that notification bell. Follow 3B Video. Subscribe to them. And subscribe to VHS Mikey. For God's sakes, buy this movie. Support it. Alright? Be sure to subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, all that good stuff, and have yourselves. A good fright.